Ah, uh, I'm tired of traveling, or fighting superstition and its many manifestations. Even though it was me who chose to debunk folklore and mysticism, little did I know I'd end up being labeled as Patrick Galloway, the man with endless occult knowledge. Before I knew it, people all over the world paid me to investigate all kinds of weird things. <laughs> as long as they paid me, I'd look into it. Funny thing though, the more I saw, the more I believe there are forces beyond our control. Creatures not explainable in any human terms. Things that make me skin crawl. I fled from Ireland and hung around Paris and London with no real purpose till the Great War started. I joined a special unit whose job it was to squelch the fears of the superstitious farm boys who made up the fighting ranks. The Trasanti were the biggest pains. New commanding officer, Jeremiah Covenant, led our unit in the hunt for their camp. We were ambushed. They came streaming out of the woods, waving swords and howling like banshees. I saw their leader holding a strange stone over his head. Patrick Galloway, a friend of Jeremiah's. Sorry it took me so long to get here. His letter said it was most urgent. Jeremiah is beginning to think that the letter never arrived in your hands. He's been quite anxious to see you. We've all been quite worried. Jeremiah's now bedridden. Follow me and I'll show you to his living quarters. apologize for the look of the house, but there's only a skeleton crew of servants now. Jeremiah let go of everyone else, and the house is much too large for us to clean. Because we've lost electricity to most parts of the house, we can only maintain the living quarters. This family's had so much tragedy. I hope you can help him. Patrick, you made it. At your service, Jeremiah. Sorry for the delay, but I've been abroad. What happened to you? It seems I've come under the watchful eye of... Jammed. Can you 
describe what you can only see? As the bonds of flesh are broken, the world becomes apparent. Jammed. Won't budge. Those beasts were after me! What in God's name were those things? They're called Howlers. Well, I've never seen one before tonight.